Hello, dear Angular developers! This is Mastering Angular series, where I want to save you some time and describe Angular gotchas from my work experience. This lesson is a free part of my future video course with advanced techniques of mastering Angular. Want to get notified when it is done? Subscribe by the link on the screen and in the description. Now let's start. Time waster number 7. Beware fork join versus zip ArcGIS operators differences. There is a nice tweet of reactive fox. If you know promise, you already know ArcGIS. In that tweet, Fox shows you how to make concurrent HTTP requests with observables. In his example, zip operator is used. But zip has some nuances you should be aware of. How it works? We create many observables that will do HTTP request with from fetch function. Zip function gets an array of such observables and subscribes them, causing HTTP requests to be performed concurrently. Zip waits until every argument observable emit values with same index, index equal 0 in our case, and emits an array of values. All argument observables produce only one value. So after all responses are fetched, Zip produce array of responses. You may think, everything is ok, and actually it is, but only in this particular case. Why? Because if you try to feed zip function with observables that produce more than one value, you will get unexpected behavior. More than one emission. To prevent such possible drawbacks, you can use fork join function. Fork join waits for all argument observables to complete and then emit an array of last emitted values. To compare, zip emits an array of values with same emission index. Now our example will look like this. Beware of that difference. Also, Lee Alexis shared this valuable feedback about fork join. If some observable will not complete, Fork join will never emit a value. Regarding network requests, which are wrapped in observables, you can prevent this by using timeout operator. But reviewing it is out of this video scope. You can find more information about timeout operator on official ArcGIS documentation site. I prepared free video course about main tools for unit testing ArcGIS code in Angular applications. Grab your copy by the provided link. Also, check my articles on Medium and Dev2 platforms to learn more about ArcGIS and Angular. Gershurus!